What's going on, guys? It's YGO Podcast back at it. If you like the channel, if you like what we do, please hit that like button, comment. If you're new here, please subscribe. Man, I got some great news for you, and I'm probably going to butcher it. I'm not even going to lie to you. The translations aren't even all up yet, but better late than never, right? It's like 10.30 p.m. here, and I'm going to tell you something right now. There are people out here who waited over a decade for this. And if you didn't know, we just got some new volcanic support announced. We dropped a much needed volcanic support. All right. And I, I mean, finally and it's you know what and it seems like it's pretty decent too so um i got it here hey man i got it all here we're gonna read it out i'm gonna throw the cards up on the screen this video is gonna be out tonight um better try to be first you know what i'm saying but the first card that we got here um and look it's gonna be this card and i'm gonna put it up there on the screen just as a reminder but the name for this card is called volcanic emperor all right so essentially what it says is that um you can remove one blaze cannon from your graveyard to special summon this card from your hand or graveyard you can only have one vault you can only use one vol uh canic emperor once per turn um yeah so essentially you can only summon them that way once per turn uh sorry these translations are really rough so i mean i already can't read y'all know that stupid so um you know, we're just going to work through what we got here, but these translations are really, really rough. All right. And um, then it says uh, it gains, it says inflict damage to your opponent equal to the number of banished monsters times 500. That's pretty freaking spicy right there. After that, you can set one volcanic card from your deck to your field. Inflict 500 damage to your opponent every time they special, every time they special summon a monster. Lord have mercy. 3,100 attack, 2,400 defense. That is a beastly effect, all right? That is really good for Volcanics. I mean, you can't ask for better support than that. Like a, another like mini boss monster, which is great. Actually, I think that is the boss monster of the deck now. It's 3,100 attack. So the next one here is this one, guys. Um, this one is called Volcanic Trooper, I believe. And its effect states that... Um, you can only use each effect of Volcanic Trooper once per turn. If this card is normal special summon, you can add one Volcanic card other than Volcanic Trooper from your deck to your hand. And two, you can discard one card, special summon one bomb token, a level one, thousand attack, thousand defense to your opponent's side of the field. And it says if this token is destroyed, inflict 500 damage uh, to its controller uh, to its controller's life points. Not bad, not bad, guys. Also, um, that really helps out with other things like evenly matched. So, I mean, Volcanics are seeming like they're, you know, they got answers for a lot of things. I think evenly matched and imperm as well, if I'm not mistaken. Anyway, um, don't don't listen to me. Let's gonna we're gonna move on to this one. It kind of looks like an older version of Volcanic Shell. Let's see what's up with this. So it's called <laughs> all right. I'm gonna have to put the uh the pause in in, in here for this one. This the name is pretty lit. Uh it says volcanic rim fire. Pause. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, okay. So, you know, all of I'm not hey, I'm not hating on on anybody, how they get their rocks off or their kicks or whatever, but um anyway, so this one says that it says when this card is sent to the graveyard, you can select and activate one of the following effects says each of the following effects with this card's name can only be selected once per turn so it says banish this card from your uh graveyard it says send one volcanic monster other than uh, rim fire uh from your deck to the uh, graveyard then it says banish one blaze cannon card from your field or your graveyard and place one blaze cannon magic card from your hand or deck to your field face up so <laughs> i mean <laughs> Some of, I mean, these are, these are getting kind of crazy. You know what I mean? Like that's really, really, really good. So far you can search, you have two cards that can pretty much search anything. And I think two cards that can set just about anything. So that's pretty good. So far, so good. So we're going to get on to the new blaze cannon spell. Um, this spell, 
let's see. Let's go ahead and try to. It says it's called. So the name of it is called Volcanic Blaze Cannon. And uh, what it says is that you can activate one by sending one blaze cannon from your hand, deck, or field <laughs> to your graveyard. Wow, pretty good, right? Um, it says you can only what? Uh, you can only control one volcanic blaze cannon. This is once per turn. You can activate during your main phase. Special summon one volcanic monster from your hand. Uh, once per turn, it can only be uh, it can only be activated by targeting one face up monster on your opponent's side of the field. Send one level one pyro type monster from your deck to the graveyard to destroy the targeted monster. So I don't know if that one's translated correctly yet. Uh, these translations are really rough, guys. Um, but for for the most part, um, seems pretty legit. You know, seems pretty legit. And then now they even have another spell card. So this is going to be a regular spell. Um, let's see what this one says real quick. This one's called uh, Fire Ejection. It's a normal spell. It says send one pyro monster from your deck to the graveyard. Then if you sent a volcanic monster with this effect, you can apply one of the following effects. Inflict damage to your opponent equal to the level times 100. Special summon one wildfire token. Oh, and you guys remember that card wildfire, right? Um, I, would get, I would start getting your stuff now uh, before people start catching on and being like oh this is a really good thing i would definitely start going ahead and jump on ebay wherever you got to jump onto and you could also jump on the troll and toad um <laughs> and use uh my uh, use my um affiliate affiliate link and uh we've got a coupon code use ygo pod five to get five percent off of all items on trollandtoad.com especially the items that uh troll and toad sells themselves not the other sellers on troll and toad so make sure it's sold by troll and toad that's where you can apply your five percent off guys perfect um so it getting back to this it says you can send one pyro mon uh send one pyro monster from your deck to the graveyard then if you sent a volcanic monster with this effect you can apply one of the following effects uh, inflict damage to your opponent equal to the level times 100 special summon one wildfire token uh, pyro fire level one a thousand attack and defense to your opponent's side of the field if that token is destroyed the controller takes 500 damage you can only activate one fire ejection um once per turn so pretty good another fire token being special summoned to your opponent's side of the field so um volcanics are it seems like they're they're really going hardcore in on um, summoning monsters to your opponent's side of the field. That's going to facilitate a lot of OTKs, guys, because you can special summon it in attack position. And if you're going second, I mean, that's a lot of OTK potential right there. Um, that's without even kaijus. It's just giving you a direct line into your opponent's guts. Oh, pause. pause. Anyway, so... You know what I'm um, saying? <laughs> I, I got to stop doing that. I got to get better about that. <laughs> so, and then now they have a continuous trap card, guys. So I don't know what the name is yet. I'm going to read it right here. It's called Volcanic Inferno. It's a continuous trap. You can only use each effect of Volcanic Inferno once per turn. It says when your opponent activates a monster effect on the field, you can banish one pyro um, monster from your graveyard, inflict 500 damage to your opponent. Then if you banish a volcanic monster, you can negate that activated effect. Ooh. Ooh. That's good. Okay. Okay. That's a negate to Barone. That's a negate to the, that's a, anyway, let's keep reading. Um, second, uh, second effect. During your opponent's end phase, you can target up to two of your volcanic monsters that are in the graveyard or banished and place them at the bottom of your deck in any order. Oh man, this is crazy, Konami. Konami, you guys have outdid yourselves. Great job. This is amazing support. Guys, people have been waiting decades for this. You can't blame me for being this excited. You can't blame me for being this excited for other folks. I had a volcanic deck uh, profile that I was gonna do, and I was also gonna put it on um, my new short series, I Hate. I was gonna do a whole thing about vol volcanics because that series is where I cover way under supported decks. So, you know, I was going to do that, but now it looks like I won't have to. It still might appear up there, though, just because. T t 10 years, 12 years, way too late. But this stuff, this is a start, a really good start. If you guys like the video, 
please like comment and subscribe man um i'm i'm excited let me know your thoughts in the comments below and i'll get back at you guys i'll holler at you guys here in a minute man come join me at the next conversation peace